Zofish, Wombles of all sizes, welcome back to Ask Gears Videos. Today I am reviewing every single 2017 America's Got Talent audition brought to you by Ask Gear. Thank you for watching and be sure to subscribe. So, uh, yeah, I am uh, doing this big project uh, on uh, every single audition that I found on the AGT YouTube channel. And I have uh, left a comment on every single one stating what I like and putting a rating out of 10. And I'll get to that in a minute. Uh, please state that America's Got Talent is a great show. So if you guys um, want me to do a mini rant on it, like how they have 40 second videos, uh, I'll get to a mini rant one day maybe. But uh, other than that, uh, I really like their show. Uh, this project is a very big project, and I'll get to all the stuff I did at the end. Uh, please note there are timestamps in the description below. So if you um, if if you're looking for me to review one of your favorite auditions, just go to just go in the description. Be sure to click on everything that I have put in store for you guys in the description, and I have put the time, the minute, and the second for you guys to go there. So, uh, I will just be sh uh, showing you guys how this works. So, I have uh, the act name on the top of the slide. The act category under it, such as singers, dancers, etc. I have the uh, season and the episode. For all of them, it's obviously season 12, but the episode uh, may vary. Uh, I have the name or names, the age or ages, the hometown, the jobs, uh, the rating out of 10. If... Uh, if a judge buzzed, uh, the X would be red inside, and if they gave the golden buzzer, all of the X's and names would be uh, gold, except the person's name who put, hit the golden buzzer. There we have the thumbnail of the YouTube video and the comment on YouTube, plus the rating I put. So, uh, these are the categories and numbers. I have colored uh, them, so it's easier to vary them. So, there are singers, dancers, comedians, magicians, bands slash choirs, ventriloquists, escapologists, danger, acro acrobats uh, slash balancers, and other, and 1 to 10, and so on. And the colors are uh, red, orange, green, light blue, dark blue, purple, light, light brown, gray, dark brown, and black. So yeah, I try to vary them a lot, and on the things, if, if they are a singer, you, it would be in red, and if the rating is, say, 10 out of 10, then it would be black. So yeah, let's get into this. Before, Without further ado, be sure to click on my old Simon Cowell video for uh, me to be talking about Simon Cowell. So yeah, do that. And be sure to sit back, subscribe, and let's get into this with our first audition from... Season 12, Episode 1, Joku of the Flock Stars. The category is Other, the names are Joku, Siri, and Shannon. The ages are unknown, the hometown is unknown, the job is unknown. I gave it an 8 out of 10. None of the, uh, none of the judges buzz. That's the thumbnail, and my comment is, I like this more than the Counting Dog. More entertaining and a bit funny. Tedious at first, but a chicken as a pianist is true talent. Otherwise, 8 out of 10 from the Super AGT Reviewer. By the way, uh, from the Super AGT Reviewer will be coming on all of them. So, yeah. So, that's a form. That's what we call a formula, kids. Next up, we have Preacher Lawson. Uh, he's a comedian. His name is Preacher Lawson. He's 26. He's from Orlando, Flo Orlando Florida. He is unemployed, as he probably joked. I don't know, uh, I gave him a 10 out of 10 rating, none of the judges buzzed, that's his thumbnail, and the comment is, this is how you do comedy correctly. He delivered funny stories and told many jokes on each topic. Hope he gets far, as he'll inspire a lot of comedians. Otherwise, 10 out of 10 from the Super AGT Reviewer. Yeah. Next up, we have Yoli Mayer. He, she is a singer, uh, her name is Yoli Mayer, her age is 21. Her hometown is Miami, Florida. Uh, her job is unknown. Uh, I gave her an 8 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. That's her thumbnail. And I said, beautiful voice at her best. Another reason I love Simon. He can make singers sing at, at their fullest potential. Thank you, Simon. And I know Yoli thinks you too. Otherwise, 8 out of 10 from the Super AGT reviewer. Yeah. 
Next up, we have the Man of Mystery, Escapologist. His name is unknown. He's 46 years old. He's from Orlando, Florida. He's, his job is unknown, and I uh, gave him a 2 out of 10. All four of the judges buzzed. That's his thumbnail. And I wrote, funny but stupid. His act was simple. The key was in the bag, and the costume also was. He untied and changed. Uh, the judges were a bit abrupt, but he deserved his buzz. Otherwise, 2 out of 10 from the Super AGT reviewer. Yeah. Next up, we have Junior and Emily Alibi. They are dancers. Um, their names are Junior and Emily Alibi. They are 31 and 27. They're from San Francisco. Their jobs are unknown, and I gave them a 7 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. Uh, that's their thumbnail on the top. And I said, very professional in modern dancing with incredible talent, but they need to make it more surprising and entertaining. Otherwise, 7 out of 10. From the Super AGT reviewer. Next up, Will Sai. He's a magician. Uh, his name is Will Sai. He's 33. He's from Vancouver, uh, BC, for, in, from Canada. Uh, his job is unknown. I gave him an 8 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. Uh, that's his thumbnail. And I wrote, a very talented guy who's cool and Canadian. Loved him. It was true magic as he left me clueless. Just need more to offer. Um, otherwise, 8 out of 10 is from the Super AGT reviewer. Next up, the singing Trump. He is a singer. His real name is unknown. His real age is 56. His real hometown is um, unknown. His real job is unknown. And I gave him an 8 out of 10. Mel B. Buzzed. That's his thumbnail. And I wrote, love this funny act and his singing talent. Um, LMAO deserved more than he got. Otherwise, 8 out of 10 from the Super AGT reviewer. Next up, we have Marikana. He's a singer. His name is Marikana. He's 12 years old. He's from Encinitas, uh, California. And... He, uh, he's unemployed, obviously, because he's 12. I gave him a 10 out of 10. He didn't get any buzzes from the judges. That's his thumbnail. And I wrote, loved his emotional and meaningful dance. His personality is great. He deserves the golden buzzer way more than Darcy. Loved it. Hope you go far, Merrick. Otherwise, 10 out of 10. From the Super AGT reviewer. Next up, we have Puddles Pity Party. He's a singer. His name is unknown. His age is unknown. His hometown is unknown and his job is unknown i gave him a 10 out of 10 uh, he got zero buzzes he I, that's his thumbnail and i wrote nice guy with great talent looks like a fun guy to be friends with otherwise 10 out of 10 from the super agt reviewer next up we have demon aditya i hope i said that right uh he is an escapologist his name's demon aditya He's 36. He's from Jakarta, Indonesia. He's un he's, His job is unknown. I gave him a 9 out of 10. No judges buzzed. And I wrote a jaw-dropping act, which is funny because he reveals himself. It is easier to predict how he did it, but it was scary the first time. Otherwise, 9 out of 10 from the Super AGT reviewer. Next up, we have Darcy Lynn. She's a ventriloquist. Her name is Darcy Farmer Lynn. She's 12. She's from Oklahoma City. Uh, she is unemployed. I gave her an 8 out of 10. She got the golden buzzer from Melby. And I wrote, I like her act. It was funny. Song was a bit bad, but she is a good ventriloquist. I think she needs to improve closing her mouth more rather than smiling. I personally think she didn't uh, deserve the golden buzzer. Merrick did. Otherwise, 8 out of 10 from the Super AGT reviewer. Next up, we have Calling Cloud. He's a magician, and this is uh, Season 12, Episode 2. His name is Calling Cloud. He's 30 years old. His hometown is unknown. His jaw, he is unemployed. Um, he, I gave him a 9 out of 10. No judges buzzed, and I wrote, OMG, I watched this so much. So funny, talented, but easy to predict how we did it. I love this guy's personality, otherwise 9 out of 10 from the Super AGT reviewer. 
Next we have Mia Moore. Uh, she is other. The names are Edna and Mia Moore. 58 and 11 are the ages. The hometown is Light Lighthouse Point, Florida. And the job is unknown. I gave her 7 out of 10. And none of the judges buzzed. I wrote talented but tedious. I was bored. I was... I was uh, bored watching a dog bark 16 times. I liked the idea and the talent, but this won't go anywhere. Liked her personality, though. Otherwise, 7 out of 10. From the Super Edgy Tier Reviewer. Next up, we have Diavolo. Uh, they are acrobats slash balancers. The names are Jack Heim and I don't know the rest. The ages are from 21 to 39. Uh... The hometown and job is unknown. I gave them a 10 out of 10. No judges buzzed. And I wrote an awesome group with great choreography and talent. Love the jumps and stuff. Who else thought their founder looked like a mix of Willem Dafoe and Liam Neeson? Otherwise, 10 out of 10 from the Super AGT Reviewer. Next up, we have Chase Goering. He is a singer. His name's Chase Goering. Uh, he's 21. He's from Nolansville, Tennessee. And his job is unknown. He, I gave him a 9 out of 10. And none of the judges buzzed. And I wrote, very cool song and singing. Reminds me of Ed Sheeran. Hope, see, hope he gets far. Otherwise, 9 out of 10 from your Super GT reviewer. Next up, we have Jimmy Slonina. He is an acrobat slash balancer. His name's Jimmy Slonina. The age, I don't want to know. The hometown is Las Vegas, Nevada. Uh, his job is probably, I have no idea, he's probably unemployed. Uh, I gave him a 1 out of 10, Simon and Heidi buzzed, uh, that's his thumbnail, and I wrote stupid and unfunny, probably the worst AGT 2017 audition, only stupid, otherwise 1 out of 10, super AGT reviewer. Next up we have Arteon and Paige, they are dancers, uh, their names are Arteon and Paige, uh, their ages are 9 and 8. They are from Murrieta, California. And they are unemployed. I gave them a 2 out of 10. Uh, Simon buzzed and I wrote, I don't like their song, them, or their dancing. Definitely going with Simon on this one. Otherwise, 2 out of 10 from the Super AGT reviewer. Next up we have Nick Juhas. He is other. His name is Nick Juhas. He's 32 years old. He's from Columbus, Ohio. Uh, his job is unknown. He has. I gave him a 10 out of 10. I wrote fun act that wasn't boring in the slightest. Loved the deep voices and blowing up Howie. Super funny and rewatchable. Hashtag Simon's worst nightmare. Otherwise, 10 out of 10 from the Super AGT reviewer. Next up, we have Pelican212. They are a band slash choir. Their names are unknown. Their ages are from 17 to 20. Their hometown is unknown. And their job is jobs are unknown. Well, for most some of them and uh i gave him a 7 out of 10 none of the judges buzzed and i wrote fun family but won't win otherwise 7 out of 10 from a super agt reviewer next up we have billy and emily england they are a danger act and their names are billy and emily england yeah uh their ages are 30 and 27 they are from las vegas nevada and their jobs are unknown I gave him a 10 out of 10, none of the judges buzzed, and uh, I wrote, very talented people, this is how you do a danger act correctly. Love their personalities and act, otherwise 10 out of 10. From the Super AGT Reviewer. Next up we have Angelica Hale. She is a singer, her name is Angelica Hale. She is 9 years old, she's from Atlanta, Georgia, and her job is unknown. Or she's uh, unemployed. She I gave her a 9 out of 10. Um, none of the judges buzzed. I wrote, she has a beautiful voice, but I find her annoying. Nice song choice as well. Otherwise, 9 out of 10. From the Super AGT Reviewer. Next, we have the Azari Brothers. They are a danger act. Because, of course, uh, their names are unknown. They are 30 and 33. They are from Guba, Az Azerbaijan. Their jobs are unknown. Uh, I gave them a 7 out of 10. Heidi and Howie buzzed. Uh, and I wrote, I don't mind the gross out that much. It was decent, but it won't mil win a million dollars. But it was talent at its best. 
although not original, uh, otherwise, 7 out of 10 from the Super AGT Reviewer. Yeah, baby, another golden buzzer. Next up, we have Mandy Harvey. She's a singer. Her name's Mandy Harvey. She's 29. She's from St. Cloud, Florida. Her job is unknown. I give her a 10 out of 10. And she got a golden buzzer from Simon Cowell, kids. Yes. I wrote, a very beautiful soul with a beautiful talent. Deserved a golden buzzer from Simon Cowell. Beautiful song and voice. Otherwise, 10 out of 10 from the Super AGT Reviewer. Keshi. She is a singer. Her name is Keshi Akwuchi. And she's 27. She's from uh, Houston, Texas. Her job is unknown. I gave her a 10 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. And I wrote, a very nice woman with a great story and beautiful voice. A better song choice would have been better, though. Otherwise, 10 out of 10 from the Super AGT Reviewer. Oscar Hernandez. A uh, dancer, his name is Oscar Hernandez, he's 34, he's from somewhere in Arizona, He his job is unknown, I give him an 8 out of 10, none of the judges buzzed, I wrote a really cool dude and good dancing, he needs to really improve as he lose to the competition, otherwise 8 out of 10 from the Super AGT Reviewer. Next we have Elena and Sasha, they are acrobats slash balancers. Uh, this is, by the way, from uh, episode 3, since Keshi. Uh, the names are Elena Sanda- Sanders and Sasha Liuti. I hope I said that right. Um, their ages are 30 and 47. They're from Las Vegas, Nevada. Their jobs are unknown. Uh, I gave them a 10 out of 10. And none of the judges buzzed. Uh, I wrote a very funny start and big talent. Like their personalities and all the cool tricks and non-repetitiveness. Otherwise, 10 out of 10 from the Super AGT Reviewer. Shanika Charles. She is another acrobat slash balancer. She, her name is uh, Shanika Charles. She's 24. She's from Buffalo. Uh, her, her job is unknown. I gave her a 9 out of 10. And um, none of the judges buzzed. I wrote, a cool lady with talent. I like the hardness of it, but she needs to improve her tricks as it was a bit repetitive and the same. Otherwise, 9 out of 10 from Super AGT Reviewer. And that is the thumbnail. Next is Big Benji. She's a singer. Her real name is Benjamin Shale. She is 73 years old. She's from Los Angeles. Uh, her, her job is unknown. I gave her 2 out of 10. Uh, none of the ju- judges buzzed. I wrote, she is so cute. As a huge Simon Cowell fan, I love this act. Uh, I love Simon's reaction. As for the act, it sucked. She won't get far. Otherwise, 2 out of 10 from the Super AGT reviewer. Next up, we have Tony and Jordan. They are magicians. Um, the names are Tony and Jordan. Because, obviously... Their ages are unknown, uh, but they're obviously the same age. Their hometown is unknown, uh, but they're, they said they were French. And their jobs are unknown. I gave them a 10 out of 10. Um, none of the judges buzzed, and I wrote, Amazing audition with good people, very talented and addicting. I hope he goes far, otherwise 10 out of 10. In the stairwell, they're a band slash choir. Their names are unknown. They're 18 to 22. They're from Colorado Springs, Colorado. Their job is a uh, Air Force Academy. Yeah, I couldn't find anything, but I figured fill up the job category. How he buzzed, I gave them an 8 out of 10. And I wrote some cool dudes who have great voices, well choreographed, and nice choir style to it. They'll... Uh, they need to improve a bit or else they won't win the show with this. Otherwise, 8 out of 10 from the Super AGT Reviewer. Next up, we have Daniel Ferguson. Uh, he's other. His name's Daniel Ferguson. He's uh, 23. He's from Youngstown, Ohio, and he's a sales representative. I'll give him a 10 out of 10. He uh, None of the judges buzzed. And I wrote, love this guy and his talent. He will hopefully be in the finals. Otherwise, 10 out of 10, ladies and gentlemen. Next up, we have the Dancing Pumpkin Man. He is a dancer. His name is Matt Gaylor. Um, His uh, age is 42. His hometown's Ohama, Nebraska. 
His job is unknown. Uh, gave him a 6 out of 10. Simon buzzed. Uh, but I wrote, cool dude with okay talent. Bad song choice. He won't win. Otherwise, 6 out of 10. Yeah, baby. We have Pompeo Family Dog. They fall into other. Their names are uh, Nat Natalia, George, and Catalina. Their ages are from 7 to 36. They are from Sarasota, Florida. And their jobs are unknown. I gave them an 8 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. And I wrote great souls with cool talent. Love the cute dogs. What bothers is people will probably compare this to better acts. Otherwise, 8 out of 10 from the Super AGT reviewer. Next up, we have Celine Tam. She's a singer. Because who isn't? And this is uh, episode 4, by the way. She is 9 years old. Her hometown is unknown. Uh, and she's unemployed. Uh, I gave her a 9 out of 10. The judges, none of the judges buzzed. I wrote, she has talent for 9 years old. Simon is awesome. She is a bit annoying in the beginning. Her song choice was great. Otherwise, 9 out of 10. Greater Works. Band slash choir. Uh, the names are Danelle Damon and I don't know the rest. Their ages are unknown. Their hometowns are Seattle, Washington, Washington, D.C., New York City, Atlanta, Georgia, Portland, Oregon, uh, dot, dot, dot. Their jobs are unknown. Uh, I give them a 10 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. And I wrote extremely talented individuals with great personalities. The song choice was excellent. Deserved golden buzzer or to at least go to finals. Uh, hope they keep it up. Otherwise, 10 out of 10. J.J. Phillips, uh, other, his name is J.J. Phillips, he's 25, he's from Cleveland, Ohio, his job is in the fiberglass factory, uh, I give him a 7 out of 10, Heidi buzzed, and I wrote, uh, an awesome dude with his talent, although he was a cool person, he isn't gonna win with this, otherwise, 7 out of 10. Light Balance, our second last, uh, golden buzzer, uh, it was Tyra's golden buzzer, who was the host, Tyra Banks. Uh, it was other, the names and age and hometown and job are unknown. I gave him a 10 out of 10. Very, fu very fun and beautiful act that deserved to, the golden buzzer. I would have definitely liked to see more. The choreography was excellent and these people are very talented. Otherwise, 10 out of 10. Next up, we have Anthony Pinoso. He is a singer. His name is Anthony Pinoso. He's 58. He's from Jacksonville, Florida, and he's an attorney. I gave him a 3 out of 10. All the judges uh, buzzed, and I wrote that the judges were too fast, but he did suck. His face when he got buzzed made me sad, but he's very impudent. Just came on to say that his wife is 25 years younger than him. Otherwise, 3 out of 10. Just Jerk. They're dancers. Uh, their names are unknown. Uh, they're 18 to 27. They're from Seoul, South Korea. Uh, their jobs are unknown. I gave them a 6 out of 10. No judges buzzed. And I wrote, this act is too overrated. The choreography was okay, but not a $1 million act. Otherwise, 6 out of 10. Men with Pans. Other, the names are Kevin and Comb. Uh, the ages are 34 and 38. The hometown is unknown, and the job is unknown. Uh, I gave him a 2 out of 10. Simon and Mel buzzed. And I wrote, the act was okay, but stupid in a bad way. It sucked. Otherwise, 2 out of 10 from the Super AGT review. Next up, we have the De Niro guy. Other. His name's Robert Nash. His age is uh, unknown. His hometown and job are also unknown. I give him a 5 out of 10. Simon, Melby, and Heidi buzzed. I wrote, I like his impression, but his act sucked. The booing was totally unnecessary. Otherwise, 5 out of 10. Tom London. He's a magician. Uh, his name is Tom London. He's 25. His hometown and job is unknown. And I gave him a 10 out of 10. Uh, all the judges didn't buzz. And I wrote, I really love this guy's personality and act. His tricks are mind-boggling. Otherwise, 10 out of 10. Bellow Knock. Uh, this is a danger act. His name is Bellow Knock. His, uh, he's 47. He's from Sarasota, Florida, and he's an entertainer. Uh, I gave him a 7 out of 10. None of the judges uh, buzzed. I wrote, I like this guy. I like his comedy, but he needs to improve his tricks. Otherwise, 7 out of 10. Darcy Callis. He's a singer. His name is Darcy Callis. Uh, he's 25. The hometown and the jobs are unknown. Uh, I gave him an 8 out of 10. 
and none of the judges buzzed. I wrote a good a good person with great talent, but song choice was okay. I don't think he'll win though. Otherwise, eight out of ten. Evie Claire, she's a singer. Uh, she, she's thirteen. She's from Florence, Arizona, and she's unemployed. She is eight. I uh, gave her an eight out of ten. None of the judges buzzed, and I wrote an intermediate singer with a good personality. Song was great, but she cried way too much. Otherwise, eight out of ten from a Super AGT reviewer. Henry Richardson. He is a magician. His name's Henry Richardson. He's fifteen. He's from New York City. Uh, he is unemployed. I give him a seven out of ten. None of the judges buzzed, and I wrote an okay magic trick boy with okay personality. Otherwise, seven out of ten. Maxim Papozov. Uh, yeah, and all of these are are uh, episode five people. He is an acrobat and balancer. Uh, his age and his hometown and his job is unknown. I gave him a 7 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. And I wrote, great talent with brilliant stunts. He is better than the girl, but winning AGT with this is impossible. He has to up his game. Otherwise, 7 out of 10. Maria Popozov. She is an acrobat slash balancer. Um, her name is Maria Popozov. Uh, her age, and hometown, and job is unknown. I gave her a 3 out of 10. Um, none of the judges buzzed, and I wrote a brat who thinks she, uh, her looks will get her noticed. She's going to break her teeth one day and regret it. Grotesque and stupid. Uh, otherwise, 3 out of 10 from the Super AGT reviewer. Next up, we have the Masqueraders. So they are a band slash choir. Their names are unknown. They're 72 to 74. They look way too young. Uh, their hometown and job is unknown, and uh, I gave them a 9 out of 10. Uh, none of the judges buzzed, and I wrote three brilliant souls who believe in miracles. They have brilliant voices and talent. Hope they get far. Otherwise, 9 out of 10. Deonce Diggs, dancer. Uh, he's 31. He's from uh, Wicamico. Uh, yeah. He's a deputy. Uh, I gave him a 1 out of 10. All the judges buzzed, and I wrote an impudent brat who thinks being a deputy is life. Trying to dance to be funny. Not funny, not talented, my grandma could dance better. I like the message, but that's about it. Otherwise, 1 out of 10. Next up, we have Sarah Carson and Hero. Other, other, uh, their ages are 22 and 5. I don't know if that's dog years or human years, but let's just go with human. She's from Ontario, Canada, which isn't specific enough. And her ch- uh, her job is unknown. I gave her a 6 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. Uh, and I wrote, I honestly thought Mel B would like this more than Simon, but Simon has a bigger heart than Mel B. Uh, anyway, I think she should improve her skills. I mean, she can't improve a dog forcefully in a short amount of time, but a little extra pizzazz would have made it a little more worthwhile. Otherwise, 6 out of 10. Johnny Manuel. Uh, he is a singer. Uh, he's 32. He's from Flint, Michigan. Uh, uh, he, uh, his job is unknown. I give him a 9 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. Uh, I wrote very beautiful and emotional. He will probably go, go close to the semifinals. Otherwise, 9 out of 10. Yeah. Circus Alfon. Other... Um, their names are Babam, Emilio, and Ave. Their ages are unknown. Their hometown is unknown. Their jobs are unknown. Uh, I gave them a 4 out of 10. Simon buzzed, and I wrote, Funny souls in comics, but not so good talent. It was funny, but it won't win $1 million. Improving is by getting better talent and sticking to comedy. By the way, I like their use of chariots of fire. Otherwise, 4 out of 10. Final draft. They're a band slash choir. Their names are unknown. Their ages are 26 to t- uh, 22 to 26, sorry. Uh, their hometown is from Atlanta, Georgia. Their jobs are unknown. Um, I gave them an 8 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. And I wrote, um, awesome souls with nice voices. A better song would have been more suitable, but they sung this very well. Otherwise, 8 out of 10. Oscar and Gasper. Other... Their names are Ungium, Eduardo, and Ruben. Uh, their ages are unknown, their hometown is unknown, and their jobs are unknown. Well, three question marks, because, yeah. 
uh, and um, I give him a 9 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. There's your thumbnail with Heidi. And I wrote, very beautiful and creative talent. Love the stuff. A little, uh, a little extra would have made would have been better. Otherwise, 9 out of 10. Vinny Grasso. He is a magician. Uh, his name's Vinny Grasso. He's 41. He's from Las Vegas, Nevada. He is a window company consultant. I never understood what that means, but whatever. I gave him a 2 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. And I wrote, he probably put flavors on the cards. For example, all the spades are bitter, and all the sevens are lime, all the hearts are sour, and all the threes are strawberry, etc. Also, I'm, uh, him going nude was completely unnecessary. He tried to be funny, but I think this isn't good magic, and Howie's the best part of it. Otherwise, 2 out of 10. Next up, we have Carlo D'Antoni. He is a singer. Uh, he's 52 years old. He's from Miami, Florida. He's a cab driver. And I gave him an uh, an 8 out of 10, which I'm going to change right now. I would have gave him a 10 out of 10, but I gave him an 8 out of 10. Um, none of the judges buzzed. He's a very cool guy. That's his thumbnail. And I wrote, a, very, a beautiful soul with beautiful talent, brilliant song choice and notes. Otherwise, 8 out of 10. From the Super AGT Reviewer. Five Alive. This is uh, episode six, the last episode for the auditions. And these guys are the first ones. They are a band slash choir. Their names are Jordan, Davey, Benny, Shannon, and Garrett. They are 18 to 20 years old. They're from Miami, Florida. Four of their jobs are unknown. One of them is a limo company. He works for a limo company. And I gave them a 6 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. And I wrote, a dumb One Direction copy who tries way too much to get fans, mostly girls. Uh, the choreography wasn't bad, as they tick me, but they ticked me off. I hate Mela. She likes these idiots more than certain other acts. Otherwise, 6 out of 10. German Cornejos Dance Company. They are dancers. I gave them, uh, their names are unknown, their ages are unknown, uh, their hometown, I wrote, probably somewhere in Argentina, and, uh, their jobs are also unknown, I gave them a 9 out of 10, uh, the, none of the judges buzzed, and I wrote, very fun and concise dance, love the people, very professional as well, and choreography was on point, otherwise, 9 out of 10. Next up, we have Angelica Green, our last golden buzzer for this video. Uh, but uh, there are four more golden buzzers, hopefully, uh, coming up in the judge cuts. So be sure to go and watch that, guys. And by the way, uh, in the making of this video, the only judge cut I have watched was the Chris Hardwick one, the first one. So, yeah. Um, if you're seeing, like, Angelica Hale didn't get the golden buzzer in here, this is just for the auditions, and everything here is not for the auditions, including their ages. So their ages could be changing, or they could be getting older, or it could be their birthday, so that doesn't affect this. It's, this is just for the auditions. Okay, so Angelica Green. She's a singer. Uh, her name is Angelica Green. She's 13. She's from Miami, Florida. She's unemployed, and I gave her an 8 out of 10. Heidi, it was Heidi's golden buzzer. And I wrote, a nice girl who has great talent. I legitimately knew how you was going to use the golden buzzer. Enjoyed it, but not one million dollar material. Otherwise, 8 out of 10. Next up, we have the Quiddlers. Uh, their names are unknown. They are other. Their ages are old enough. Um, they're from Las Vegas, Nevada. And their jobs are also unknown. Uh, I gave him a 7 out of 10, and the, all the judges didn't buzz. I wrote, creative and funny, reminds me of last year's people, but not a copy. This says comedy correctly, very silly and over the top, but unfortunately probably won't get far. Otherwise, 7 out of 10. Next up we have Harrison Greenbaum, the second comedian. That's sad. His name is Harrison Greenbaum, he's 30 years old, he's from New York City, and he's a comedian. Um, I gave him a 5 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed, and I wrote a normal comedian who didn't have enough. The gay jokes were repetitive and shortly executed. I uh, hope he improves as he seems like a promising comedian. Otherwise, 5 out of 10. Next up we have Jonathan Rinney. He is an acrobat slash balancer. Uh, his name's Jonathan Rinney. Uh, he, he's 25 years old. He, he's from Boston, Massachusetts. 
and his job is probably this. Um, I gave him a 7 out of 10, none of the judges buzzed, and I wrote, this guy is talented, but he didn't seem good at it. While I disagree with he- with Heidi when I say uh, he wasn't confident, I think he seemed too amateur. The, uh, the act was too short, and I want to see more. Otherwise, 7 out of 10. Mike Young. He's a singer, his name is Michael Young, and he's 50-some. He's from New York City, and he's unemployed. Um, he's 10 out of 10, I give him a 10 out of 10, none of the judges buzzed, and I wrote, I love this guy, he is a great guy and has uh, a sensational voice and talent, hope he gets far. I officially hate Mel after this, from signs like her arrogance while being with Tapeface, her mind was harder to Howie and Colin Cloud's performance, and her liking some stupid boy band and a dancing pumpkin more than this. Otherwise, 10 out of 10. Kenyon Shijirbat. He is a dancer, uh, he's 26 years old, his hometown and job is unknown. I give him a 4 out of 10, none of the judges buzzed, and I wrote very repetitive and boring. Anyone can choreograph themselves with pictures on screen, otherwise 4 out of 10. Danilo and Oscar. Uh, these are uh, these guys are acrobats slash balancers. Uh, their names are Danilo and Oscar, they are 40 and 8. Uh, their hometown and job is unknown, but they seem to be Ukrainian. There, uh, I gave them a 7 out of 10, and none of the judges buzzed. Uh, I wrote, why would you do this to a child? I liked Oscar's funny lines in the act, but this is mean to the kid. Otherwise, 7 out of 10. Mirror Image. They are a band slash choir. Their names are Colton and Trent. Um, their ages are 16, or their age, because they're twins. Uh, they're from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, and they, they their jobs are unknown. I gave them a 3 out of 10. Uh, none of the judges buzzed, and I wrote, They get more than they deserve as they are nice. I like their personalities, uh, but the act sucks, and the choreography and singing was horrible. Going with Simon on this one. Otherwise, 3 out of 10. Blindfolded veggie cutting. Wow, I actually did that accent right. But um, people get confused on this title. It, it, it's either Vispy, Cussed, and Team India or Blindfolded Veggie Cutting. I don't know, but he said Blindfolded Veggie Cutting in, in the um, audition. So, it's a danger act. The names are Vis- Vispy, um, Cassid, and another Vispy. Their ages are unknown. Uh, they're from Napsari, India. Their jobs are unknown, and I give them a 6 out of 10. Mel B, Heidi, and Howie buzzed. Uh, and I wrote, like, Dustin jo- Dojo, except not stupid and funny. Really cringy and never want to see it again. They are talented, but one guy is the one who gets uh, repeatedly badly hurt. And one is the idiot who can't hit lighter. Otherwise, 6 out of 10. And our last audition. Wow, I didn't think we'd get here. It's Brandon Rogers. He's a singer. Uh, his name's Brandon Rogers, and of course, he's the he, the last one has to be the one that dies at twenty nine. So, uh, yeah, R. I. P. Brandon Rogers. Uh, condolences to his family and friends. Uh, from uh, October thirty eighty seven to uh, June June eleventh twenty seventeen. Uh, his hometown's Portsmouth, 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 Virginia. Sorry. And he's a doctor. Uh, I gave him a 10 out of 10. None of the judges buzzed. And I wrote, really talented man and didn't deserve what he got. Condolences to his family and friends. No matter if he's here or not, he's looking down today as a very talented man. Many dictators and criminals live forever. And a talented and nice doctor dies at 29. Truly sad. Also, he's a Scorpio like me, which automatically makes him great. (laughs) Everyone agrees with me when I say yes. Otherwise, 10 out of 10. From... The Super AGT Reviewer. Viewer. 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 So, yeah. Now I'm going to go over uh, all of the... Um, all of the categories. And the, the whatever out of 10. And tell you guys uh, who was in which one. So, let's get started with singers. There were 17 singers. 
Okay, I'm gonna try to do this fast. Yoli Mayer, Singing Trump, Puddles Pity Party, Chase Goring, Angelica Hale, Mandy Harvey, Keshi, Big Benji, Christian Gordino, Celine Tam, Anthony Pinoso, Dorsey Callis, Evie Claire, Johnny Manuel, uh, Carlo D'Antoni, Angelica Green, and Mike Young. There were nine dancers, and they were Junior and Emily Alibi, Mary Canna, Artin and Page, uh, Oscar Hernandez, Dancing Pumpkin Man, Just Jerk, Deonce Diggs, German Cornejo's uh, Dance Company, and Canyon Shizurbat. There were two measly comedians, uh, Preacher Lawson and Harrison Greenbaum. There were six magicians, Will Sy, Colin Cloud, Tony and Jordan, Tom London, Henry Richardson, and Vinnie Grosso. Uh, as for uh, bands and choirs, there were seven, Pelican 212, In the Stairwell, Greater Works, Masqueraders, uh, Final Draft, and Five Alive, and Mirror Image. There was one measly uh, ventriloquist, Darcy Lynn. Um, there were two esca escapologists, The Man of Mystery and Demon Aditya. There were four danger acts, uh, Billy and Emily England, Osiri Brothers, Bellow Knock, and Blindfolded Veggie Cutting. Uh, as for uh, acrobats slash balancers, there were six, Diavolo, Jimmy Slonina, Alina and Sasha, Maxim Popazov, Mario Popazov, and uh, Jonathan Rini. And last but not least, for other, there were 12. Okay, I'm going to try to do this as good as possible. Joke over the flock stars, Mia Moore, Nick Uhas, Daniel Ferguson, Pompeo Family Dogs, JJ Phillips, Light Balance, The Nero Guys, Sarah Carson and Hero, Circus Alphon, uh, Oscar and Gasper, and The Quiddlers. Now let's move on to 1 out of 10. There were two 1 out of 10s, Jimmy Slonina and Deonce Diggs. There were uh, four 2 out of 10s, The Man of Mystery, Artyon and Page, Big Benji, and Vinny Grosso. There were three 3 out of 3s, Anthony Pinoso, Mario Popazov, and Mirror Image. There were two 4 out of 10s, uh, Circus Alfo and Canyon Chizurbat. There were two 5 out of 10s, uh, there were De Niro Guy and uh, Harrison Greenbaum. There were 5 6 out of 10s, Dancing Pumpkin Man, Just Jerk, Sarah Carson and Hero, Five Alive, and Blindfolded Veggie Cutting. Uh, there were 10 7 out of 10s. Uh, Junior and Emily Alibi, Mia Moore, Pelican 212, Ozuri Brothers, J.G. Phillips, Bello Knock, Henry Richardson, Maxim Pobazov, The Quiddlers, and Jonathan Rennie. There were 13 whopping 8 out of 10s. Joke over the flock stars, Yoli Mayer, Will Sy, Singing Trump, Darcy Lynn, uh, Oscar Hernandez in the stairwell, Pompeo Family Dogs, Darcy Callis, Evie Claire, Final Draft, Carlo D'Antoni, and Angelica Green. As for 9 out of 10, there were 9. Demon Aditya, Colin Cloud, Chase Goyering, uh, Angelica Hale, Celine Tam, The Masqueraders, Johnny Manuel, Oscar and Gasper, and German Cornejo's Dance Company. And last but not least, there were a whopping 16 10 out of 10s with, uh, with Preacher Lost and Maricana, Puddles Pity Party, Diavolo, Nick Uhas, Billy Nemley England, Mandy Harvey, Keshi, Eleni and Sasha, Tony and Jordan, Daniel Ferguson, Christian Gordino, uh, Greater Works and Light Balance, Tom London, and Mikey Young. Let's move on to Golden Buzzers. There were Darcy Lynn by Mel B, uh, Mandy Harvey, Simon, Christian Gordino, Howie, uh, Light Balance, Tyra, and Angelica Green by Heidi, ladies and gentlemen. And now for the sad to get four no's and to be sent home. We have The Man of Mystery, Jimmy Slonina, Big Benji, Anthony Pinoso, De Niro Guy, Deontay Diggs, and Blindfolded Veggie Cutting. So let's look at the graphs. For uh, categories, uh, this is the graph for categories, uh, as you can see. Uh, we have 17 singers, 9 dancers, 2 comedians, 6 magicians, 7 bands and choirs, uh, one ventriloquist, two escapologists, four danger, and uh, six acrobats, and 12 others. And as for the uh, whatever out of 10s, we have two 1 out of 10s, four 2 out of 10s, three 3 out of 10s, two 4 out of 10s, five 2 5 out of 10s, five 6 out of 10s, 10 four, 7 out of 10s, 13 8 out of 10s, 9 9 out of 10s, and 16 10 out of 10s. I'm sorry if that didn't make sense. 
Okay, um, now, like everything, I'm gonna do notes. What I thought was very cool, or uh, I, that I noticed about this season. So, the first thing is, Simon was way much nicer in this season. Uh, it's probably because he, he's a father now, if anyone's wondering. Uh, and, yeah, he's just very nicer, and I know people have noticed. Uh, he's very nice, which is uh, showing in when he gives his golden buzzer to Mandy Harvey, how he talks to Christian Gordino, and stuff like that. Melby was more unlikable this season, because uh, there has to be an up and down in this and yeah, uh, I already talked about this, her Colin Cloud performance, her Mike Young performance, how she loved um, the men with pants, or not not her, uh, or um, how she loved Dancing Pumpkin Man more than, uh, more than Mike Young. Uh, another one is there were a ton of singers this season. Think about it. There were, uh, I think there were 17, right? Yeah, there were 17. Let me just check. Uh, yeah, wait, uh... Yeah, there were 17 singers. Wow, how do you have that? And then uh, another thing is there were a lot more kids. I haven't counted, but uh, just to say it off the top of my head, um, we have Christian Gordino, we have um, Darcy Lynn, we have uh, Angelica Green, Angelica Hale, Celine Tam, all those 9-year-olds, and then we have all those 12-year-olds, uh, Darcy Lynn, Mary Canna, and then we have the older generation of 13 year olds and 16 year olds and everything and actually if you guys think about it there were a lot of golden buzzers this this year and two of them were kids two of them were kids one was a 29 year old mandy harvey one was like 40 year old men or 35 year old or whatever for a light balance um then there was christian gordino and angelica hale and darcy lynn so that makes three so there's a 12 year old a 16 year old and a 13 year old to get a golden buzzer this year you know how good that is and last but not least, uh, I know this isn't really important, but I noticed it. But there were a lot of similar similar names, such as Angelica, Angelica Green, and Angelica Hale. That actually messed me up as I was doing this. I thought I made a mistake. So, yeah, and if you guys think about it, there's a lot more that are the same. Um, so, yeah. Um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I know this took a long video, while to make. I haven't made any long videos like this for ever. Um, so, like, please uh, be sure to like and subscribe. I, I put a ton, a ton of effort into this. Like, you can't even imagine. I had to, uh, just, to just to make it easy for you guys, like a short story, I had to first watch all of them, obviously. I had to leave a comment. I had to... Screenshot all of the th all of the thumbnails and the comments. I had to crop all of them, email them to myself, and then put them on my computer. Put them all into the drives, and then I had to take every single person's information, and um, I used some other stuff, which I'll be mentioning in a second, uh, to do that. And then I had to make all of the slides, put them all in, put all the information in to make it pretty for this video. And then I had to put them all into categories. Say, okay, there were seventeen singers. These are their names. Blah blah blah. Make all those slides. And then voice it, and then I had to email it to myself, and I had to cut this video and do it too, and then put it together, and blah, blah, blah. So I would really appreciate it if you guys, uh, you know, like this video and subscribe, and comment down below what you think on my thoughts. Um, yeah, and I had to do uh, the, the timestamps too, so. No, I'm not done yet. But uh, yeah, be sure to comment down below on what your thoughts were if you disagree with me. Uh, be sure to check out my other videos on my channel. I do a lot. Um, thank you to America's Got Talent Fandom Wikia, because it helped me a lot in the information. I was doing all the information, and then I searched AGT on Google, and I t it turned out there was a Wikia, so I had to start everything over and then do it again. But it, it really helped me do this. So, uh, yeah, shout out to you guys. And uh, it helped me get, you know, the ages and the names and everything. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. This is 